If you want to look big, like Andre the Giant. Get your coffee, Dominique! Merchandise! Tell you something about Bruno San Martino, if I may okay. continue to hijack the interview here. That's fine. Please. The most honorable human being that I ever had to deal with. Really? And I guess because you're Bruno, you can do this. I had Bruno booked to do an episode of of uh, Timeline, History of WWE. He was going to cover the 60s. Listen, when you have George Steele, you do 1986, right? When you have Bruno, you do an episode called The 60s, and you go over all of it, right? Yeah. So, I, I mean, I commissioned an artist to do a, a, a painting of him, which we duplicated and sold obviously but but to, to, to i commissioned the, the painting he was a sports pa a painter on you uh, an asian uh, artist we have this whole thing for bruno they eat up too much of his time at the autograph signing beforehand we're not going to have time to shoot it i'm like bruno and so he says to me he goes listen I have a friend that has a studio in pittsburgh you come out there we shoot it there and blah 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 shook my hand Two weeks after that. Now, I knew this was coming, and, and I was much more nervous than everybody else because I knew Paul was flying out there at Triple H, not London, right. to uh, have a meeting about the Hall of Fame. So I knew there was a chance he'd be able to do nothing very right. soon right. for several years. Yeah. So it happens. They make the announcement. Bruno's in Connecticut. This is a true story. Bruno's in Connecticut. However many weeks after our failed attempt, he says, listen, before anything, I owe these guys in New Jersey a video. So I'm wow. going to do that. And then we'll do this. They said, Bruno, what do you, what? So Bruno calls me. He tells me this whole story. He said, Sean, the reason I'm telling you this is I want to tell you the ridiculous amount I told them you were paying me. He was oh. so fucking smart. He knew they would buy him out right there. Yeah. He told them some ridiculous amount. They went, okay, go do the video with those guys in New Jersey. And, th and then you're done for, for two years for the, I wow. couldn't believe it. And he can't, he shot the video and he was just so smart. He was just so wise. And, and then of course I have the other ones who, you know, people who don't call me back when it's, you know, hall of fame time. Cause God. <laughs> Come on. Coughed. What did you say? Um, uh, no, oh, I know what you, I heard what you said. I, 